It's Saturday about 12.30 and I'm uh, headed to the Astor Green Market to get lunch. Today I woke up early at 7 to meet with my classmate and get some work knocked out at 8 a.m. because he was up early too. Uh, we're behind an EP and we both have things to do later in the week. So we wanted to knock out as much as we could in the morning and not have to panic about it on Sunday night. We don't have anything due until Friday, but we changed ideas so we need to meet with our team on Wednesday and give them an update on Monday. So that's where we are. And I am so excited for it to be over, but we're getting through it, I think. And now I'm going to relax for a few hours and walk around and get some sun or rain today. I will catch up with you later. I'm at Gloucester Green Market again. Oxford is a very traditional English town, which means if I want something with flavor that's not British pub food, I go to Gloucester Green Market. And since Oxford is a very old university, there are also lots of good cafes around. So here I am getting another latte from Society Cafe. City center in the weekends is starting to look like a real city again and less like a ghost town. So today it was the weekend and I spent the day walking around and eating sweets. Oh! Full and part time. Should I work for this ice cream shop? Probably get a discount, might be worth it. wise to do a Sunday before we go for a roast. We concluded it's all right I think to it's have fine. an ice cream Sunday before we have Sunday roast. So I was productive this morning and was up in the study room at 11.30 doing my EP project like a good student. And I still need to interview Prep more. I, I looked at some of the interview questions and some responses. There's still a ways to go. Oh, it's a sandwich. Yeah, if you think. Mm. This cookie is freaking amazing. Mm -hmm. Today I learned that ice cream shops in the UK are not like ice cream shops in America, where the Sundays are freaking enormous. But this shop was a local mom and pop shop and it had really good ice cream and really good cookies. So all of the separate components of a sundae were so good. I don't think I vlogged much of the school before and a lot of the colleges are still closed. But this area is pretty much the heart of the campus with shops here and there. So we're just walking around and I hope you enjoy the views. Oh, there you go. <laughs> I'm gonna show it on the camera. <laughs> 
about 1 p.m. and I'm headed to meet my classmate for some coffee. Um, we were both interviewing for Bain together so we sort of bonded over casing and she was she got the Japan role and I didn't get the offer um, but that's okay. We're just going to catch up a bit and we're in the same EP team so we might need to talk a little about it and hopefully I don't have to deal with that for the next few days and I can get the interview with this new company over with. Yesterday was so rainy and so windy, I didn't even <laughs> vlog the rest of the day. It was just too wet and cold. It was like, I don't know what it was, but it made me cranky and I've just stayed in my bed the rest of the day when I got home. I really want to just do a good interview. I get interview fatigued pretty quick. Um, so I've been not really going to class this week and just recovering mentally and preparing myself mentally. We'll see how it goes. Oh, I didn't know a company could partner with Home Bargain. Well, Home Bargain is a freaking empire. Never walked down this aisle. I'm going to take this moment oh, while so I'm freaking out over this fuzzy caterpillar and end this vlog and say thank you for watching and I'll Why see you in the next one. This? Bye. Oh my god.